Please welcome the chairman of Points of Light, Neil Bush. Thank you. Thank you, thank you very much. Welcome to Points of Light's conference on volunteering and service. We're so excited you're here. This will be a fruitful and amazing three days together. And welcome to Hotlanta, Point <laughs> Points of Light's hometown and the hometown of our title sponsor, UPS. UPS just announced, is there for UPS? <laughs> UPS just announced that David Abney will become its CEO in September. We are thrilled to have him here today with us with this conference, as big as it is, we love logistics too. <laughs> <laughs> thank you, UPS, for your support, and thank you to all of our sponsors and to our host committee members. I want to give a special shout out to a, a tireless and amazing Ann Kramer, who served as our host committee planning chair this year. Ann sitting, stand up, Ann. Let's hear it for Ann Kramer. Thank you, Ann. She really is amazing. Uh, this is kind of a family affair. No, my daughter Lauren's not here, Pierce isn't here, but Chelsea Clinton is in the house today. <laughs> Chelsea, as you know, is the daughter of Bill Clinton, my brother from another mother. <laughs> so I guess that makes her what? Oh, that makes her my niece. So <laughs> we have a fabulous program coming up. Our conversations, you might notice the new ticker thing up here. Our conversations will be two-way. Uh, please note these tickers and feel free to tweet and text your comments throughout the session. Uh, my, mo my father's always said, if you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything at all, but feel free to tweet and text anything that's on your mind. Uh, a quick family update. Uh, my father, George Bush, um, re recently celebrated his 90th birthday. Yeah. Five years ago, Dad parachuted for his 85th birthday, and he vowed to do it again on his 90th. My father is confined to a wheelchair. He has really no practical use of his legs anymore, and so he fell 6,000 feet to the ground and landed at his church, St. Martin's Church in, in Kennebunkport, Maine. Three lessons we can take from this. One, when you're older, set goals. Have something to look forward to. Two, don't give up living at any age. Live life to the fullest. And three, if you're going to parachute jump at the age of 90, plan to land near your church. <laughs> because no matter how the jump turns out, it's a good place to either thank God or meet your maker. <laughs> I actually stole that line from my mother from five years ago. <laughs> um, one more birthday update. Uh, three organizations related to my father devised different ways to commemorate his birthday. I'm curious what you think is the most appropriate. One of them asked for money. Boo! <laughs> Another is having a sock design contest in, in honor of my dad's fetish uh, for, for crazy socks. You know, that one's kind of interesting to me. But Points of Light has asked people to honor Dad by committing to serve. And if, okay. and if you haven't already done so, please go to b1.pointsoflight.org. Pointsoflight.org. Please sign up to serve. It's an amazing app, and it's very easy to use. Of all the gestures, Dad loves this one the best. When Dad launched Points of Light 24 years ago, he had a, an important disruptive idea that every person can change lives. I bet you're thinking, hey, what's so disruptive about that? At the time, believe me, it was disruptive to say that government can't do it all, that experts don't have all the answers, that volunteers can come together to solve community problems. I'm a big fan of disruption. It's brought us American independence, civil rights, moon landings, microwave ovens, the internet, disposable diapers. I really like the disruption that's happening in the volunteer service movement these days. I like skills-based volunteering and all the people and companies that are giving what they know best, their expertise. 
I like campaigns like Giving Tuesday that follows Black Friday, the beginning of the holiday season of charitable giving. And I like that this coming year, thanks to Points of Light, people will be able to, to pledge their money and their time. I like all of the new online tools that make it easier for people to volunteer, like the new All for Good app that lets nonprofits recruit volunteers on Facebook and lets them invite their Facebook friends to join them. I like accelerators too, the, the new way to give entrepreneurs a jump start. Points of Light Civic Accelerator has boosted 48 ventures now, all designed to solve so, uh, pressing social and environmental issues through potentially transformative innovations. Today, right here, right now, I like what I see, thousands of disruptors getting together to do great things. I don't like that. I love that. This conference is the one place where leaders from business, nonprofits, and government come together to build and lead a more powerful, more vibrant volunteer sector. It's the one place where people leave their differences of race, income, politics, religion, age, and geography at the door, and we unite in finding better ways to help others in need. That's the best kind of disruption. Thank you for being here and for being a disruptor. Have a fantastic conference. Thank you. Thank you.